Um, good morning, Lenara. How are you? Good morning, Natalie. I'm fine. What about you? I'm fine. I'm totally fine. <laughs> I'm ready to start our lesson. Me too. Me too. And today we will have an interesting lesson. We will talk about different challenges in our life. Have you ever had any challenges in your life? Do you know what the, what challenge means? Uh, challenge, it's a special uh, condition in your life for mm -hmm. special time. Years, right? <laughs> sure. Or long period. Years, it's something, it's uncommon. Uh -huh. Maybe, yeah, it's something hard and uh, difficult. Not, not, mm -hmm. uh, uh, not comfort situation for you, maybe. Yes, right. But Not can very be pleasant. Mm -hmm. for you. Mm -hmm. Yeah, but uh, in the future it can be pleasant for you when you overcome your challenges, when you cope with it, this challenge, right? Cope, cope, cope with the challenge. Cope with the challenge. It means that you uh, can deal with it. Mm -hmm. Okay. So, Natalie, uh, I would like to share my experience uh, about taking part in one challenge. And uh, uh, I want you to share your experience too, okay? So, uh, last summer, I decided to give up on eating sugar. Any sweets, any cookers, ice cream, so anything which contains sugar. And so, even just in the pocket. Yeah, right. I didn't even drink juice. Yeah. Mm -hmm. <laughs> so I can say that uh, the first week was pretty hard because, you know, in summer I don't work a lot and it was my, how to say it, <laughs> it saved my life because if I worked and if I didn't eat sugar, it would be a disaster for me. Well, uh, I know that the sugar is very, very bad for your house. So that's why I decided to try how can I survive without it? So I, I just tried to reduce sugar by small parts. So mm -hmm. I didn't eat sweets, candies, any biscuits, cakes, and so on, any pies. It was hard. The first week I felt really, really <laughs> sad and disappointed because you didn't get energy and you didn't get glucose for your brain. But uh, the second week was much easier uh i don't know why maybe i just got used to it but i started eating a lot of fruits you can't imagine i could eat for a day three plums two apples grapes i know, I know the reason why you eat fruits because <laughs> why? Fruits, uh, fruits have sugar yes Except right right it's the natural yeah. sugar in the fruits and uh it's not correct to think if you not eat sugar, uh, like a real sugar, uh, it means you, you can eat sugar, you can eat, um, uh, you can eat sugar in the fruits and uh, I, no, I don't know uh, where I can find the sugar. Uh, so it's different types of sugar. So in, for example, in candies, you get glucose, yes? But in fruits, you get fructose, yes? Yeah, but it's, it's, it's sweetie. Yeah. Yes. Yes. And yes, it's sweet. But uh, you know that the taste of fruits changed. I was shocked because apples seem tastier for me. Uh, I don't know. Um, also, kiwis seemed tastier to me. I didn't feel that they were so tasty. <laughs> I don't know why. They seemed very, very tasty because I didn't eat sweets, I guess. Um, I tried it for like uh, two months mm -hmm. and I realized that my brain started two working. Months, two months, it's a lot. Yes. Years, years. But my brain started working better. I liked it. I, I liked the results, but still, after finishing it, I started eating sweets again. <laughs> <A lot. laughs> uh, I think it's okay. Too. It's okay. You try to be. Uh, you try to eat uh, sugar. You try to eat uh, veg vegetables. 
Uh, it's like tongue twisters, yeah. Yeah, and, uh, and I think it's uh, it was uh, easy for you because it was summer. There yeah. were a lot of fruits, yeah. Yeah, true, true. But if it was in winter, I don't know. It would be hot, I think, in winter or in spring. Yes. Mm -hmm. So, well, it was my challenge. I couldn't say that I cope with it yes i didn't eat sugar for two months but then now i'm i'm eating everything i can eat cake sugar sweet no. actually I don't eat sugar itself i don't drink tea with sugar i always drink tea with lemon that's it no sugar i, I eat i can eat a lot of sweets it's not good <laughs> I, I actually I just, uh, uh, I, in my uh, in my life I have I had different uh, relationship with chocolate. Oh, <laughs> I remember okay. when I was a chocolate person when <laughs> I uh, went to, uh, to home mm -hmm. after you went home. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Uh, mm, I like eating uh, chocolate one chocolate. In the moment, oh, every day, every day. Yeah, yeah it was every day. No. Uh, when I was uh, pregnant, for example, in the first month, uh, uh, it was uh, no, uh, it was it was not okay for me to eat chocolate. I didn't want to eat chocolate. Mm, really? Yeah, but now I uh, I like uh, cacao chocolate. Mm -hmm. I don't know how to say. Maybe bitter, bitter chocolate. Yes, bitter. I bitter know, chocolate. I know. Milk chocolate. Yeah. Yes. 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 Uh -huh. chocolate. Dark chocolate. Yes. And dark chocolate is usually bitter. Bitter water. Bitter. Bitter. Mm -hmm. bitter. Mm -hmm. It's a more natural. Uh, yes. Yeah. Um, hard taste, I think. Yeah, of course. And now uh, I uh, I like eating candy, but not all. All not all. It was uh, it's starting with my uh, childhood when my I remember my uncle um, got me uh, gave me I guess it gave me gave me uh, gave, gave me, me um, the chocolate and I said. Sorry, I didn't eat it. <laughs> <laughs> so you were eating it? No, um, because I it's not tasty for me. Oh I my can't god! Eat, uh, all chocolates. You you were so picky, yes, picky. It means that you choose the chocolate, yes. You don't eat these or these chocolates, yes. Yeah. You're so picky. <laughs> I see, I see. Well, you're like my mom. She also chooses types yeah. of chocolate picky i'm a picky in um, chocolate in chocolate yeah. and in uh, yes. food in general oh, i see i see so you're a very picky person mm -hmm. well and uh, if uh, so tell me your secret what what uh, kinds of chocolate do you eat what kind of candy do you eat <laughs> dark Butter, butter chocolate. Ah, okay. Butter chocolate. I like sometimes I uh, eat uh, Ritter Sport. Oh. Chocolate. Oh, 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 oh. Yeah. Yeah, I know. Yes, it's, it's very tasty. I like Ritter Sport. But so it's your favorite. Practice good. <laughs> <laughs> so is it your favorite brand? Yes. Is it your favorite brand? Uh, uh, Babaevsky. Ah, Babaevsky. Mm -hmm. Also good, also good. Well, I, I like, uh, actually, I like Herrero Roche. Oh! <laughs> no, I, actually, I don't like Herrero Roche, to be honest. I don't think there is difference between Herrero Roche or, for example, Korpunov. For me, they taste the same. Inside of Herrero Roche, uh, Nutella. Do you like it? Yeah. 
Mm, I'm oh, neutral. I don't like Nutella. No, I'm neutral to it. I'm just neutral to it. I don't think that I adore it, but no, no. <laughs> yes. You are the second person what I, uh, I, who I know uh, who doesn't like uh, Nutella. Really? Who is the first one? Michael. <laughs> my husband. My husband. Yuri, oh. my husband. <laughs> no. no, I'm not your husband. <laughs> well, I don't think that Nutella. Well, I think um, actually, I think uh, I have a German mood today. <laughs> oh my God, no, no, no. Huh? Well, uh, actually, uh, I think Nutella is too sweet. Too sweet. 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 Mm. Yeah, yeah. That's German mood is not good. <laughs> Eating German chocolate is good, but German mood so. <laughs> okay. Yeah. Well. Yeah. And about uh, it's my turn. Mm -hmm. uh, about my experience uh, in uh, talent. Yeah. Yes. Uh, in, the, in the in the last uh, summer or also. Um, I didn't eat specially. I found myself in this situation. I realized two weeks, uh, I didn't, uh, very, uh, cold as for me. Ah, okay. Uh, okay. Two months, yes? Two weeks, two weeks. Ah, two. <laughs> okay. two weeks. Two weeks. I thought, well, for myself, for my husband, for my uh, son, yeah. Okay, so two weeks. Okay, two weeks. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Uh, uh, I did. Uh, I I found myself in this situation. I feel okay. Maybe it was the summer, and in this, uh, we don't want to buy a lot of clothes in the summer. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. We have t-shirts. Uh, skirts and so on yeah mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Uh, yeah it actually it was easy for me and i was satisfied that i uh, think about our bu budget budget but budget budget and it was for uh two months i think I didn't buy for myself. For myself, it's one hundred percent about my uh, husband and son. I don't remember actually. So I think for husband it's okay too. But as for son, so you sometimes you need some, for example, tops. Uh, I don't know some uh, small stuff. Yes, it's okay. But the baby. Yeah, but no, baby. we have uh, grandmothers and. Uh, another relatives and another person who likes to uh, get him presents. It's good, it's good, yeah. So you can tell, we need this, this, and this. You can no, no, give no, no. them. They, they decided, <laughs> they decided uh, to buy it uh, for, for their reason. They, ah, they, okay. they okay. themselves, yeah. Themselves, yes, oh, I see, I see. So, and, Mm, did you save enough? Uh, did you save a lot of money? How did I don't? Uh, I don't remember actually. <laughs> but I remember that uh, it was okay for me not to buy a lot of uh, clothes. Mm -hmm. Okay, okay, that's good. That's good. Well, as for me, it's. <laughs> I think it's hard to <laughs> not to buy clothes. Um, I cannot buy any sweets, but when I started this challenge, I was shocked because when my friends visited me, they always bring sweets, cakes, and ice cream and started eating in front of me. I was like, what are you doing? <laughs> Don't do it. <laughs> they were teasing ah, me. I can say now it's not, of course, it's not a challenge, but uh, now you, you know, we have a religion, um, this, strict rule in this time uh, what rule? products uh, i don't know how to say post post post, post. Ah, yeah. oh, oh it's a difficult uh, word in english yeah so 
Are and you follow? No, I don't eat uh, eggs, meats, milk, cheese. Mm -hmm. It mm -hmm. uh, it's going to be for for forty days, I think. Oh. Forty days. So you you don't eat anything. So what about your husband? Does does he also follow? No, no, no. You see, it's a cat. You see, cat. Oh no, do you see cat? Yes, yeah, I see. I see. Yes, yes, yes. Uh -huh. uh, it's Hello. a cat. It's a. Is it a friend? Padushka. Ah, pillow. Pillow. Here, it's a pillow. pillow. Oh, I see. You. So comfortable and cozy. Well, uh, he, he's sitting on my. Shelves. Sofa. Ah, shelf. Is it sofa or is it a shelf? It's my shelf. Ah. <laughs> looks ah. like he's sitting on my shelves. No, no, no. Shoulder. Shoulder. Ah, shoulder. Yeah, of course. <laughs> <laughs> I'm, an excellent, I'm an excellent uh, student. Yes, I was thinking, where is the shelf? Where is the shelf? Yeah, okay. <laughs> sitting on your shoulder, yes. Sure, <laughs> sure. The first sound is sure. The first sound is the same, yes. But yeah. yeah. Well, challenges. <laughs> well, I think challenges are hard to take, yes. Challenges are really hard to take, but. Yeah, uh, it's, uh, I think it's easy for the short period. Yeah, for it's easy. Yeah, and uh, after challenge, uh, sorry, after challenge, you have strong desire to eat it or to to buy it. Yeah, yes, yes. Sometimes it's good, sometimes it's not. Because after my challenge, I ate a lot of sweets because I was just I don't know. I just wanted to eat them. So, uh, well, I think if you. Challenges sometimes are good, sometimes are not. If you want to restrict something, uh, you shouldn't take it like as a challenge. So you should just understand it. I don't need to eat a lot of sugar, so I can eat some, but not a lot. Yes? Yeah. One candy in a week, two candies in a week, yes, but not a lot. Still, it's hard not to eat sweets <laughs> for me, especially. Well, so, and uh, do you have any other challenges on your mind? Uh, yeah, I have. Yeah, I have. And um, now uh, I can say that I'm um, almost uh, the full to this challenge. <laughs> but not one, no, but not for 100%. Okay. So, but as for your um post yes i think it's mm, it's so you do it not just for religious purpose but also for how to say it for uh making clean your body yes to make pure your uh, body it's not about body actually it's about your soul oh uh, you feel stronger after you after this uh, experience i can say mm -hmm. okay. you feel more, you feel uh holiday mm -hmm. easter. you feel easter more uh, stronger than if you did it if you eat mm -hmm. meat or so on mm -hmm. okay well uh, how to feel easter mm -hmm. well actually um, as for Christian post, I like it because you just uh, take off some food, yes, like meat, eggs, yes, from your uh, everyday meals. But as for Muslim post, it's kind of very, very strict. Yeah. So, yeah, it's very strict because uh, you're not supposed to eat during the day. So from sunrise to sunset you're not supposed to eat anything but you can eat everything what you want at night uh it's strange at night uh, you can eat at, at night? night yes after the sunset you can eat everything what you want but during the day you shouldn't eat anything 
Oh my God. Actually, it's uh, not difficult. It's, it's too difficult. difficult challenge. Yes, and especially this post during 30 days and during one of the summer months. And summers in my city are pretty hot. I don't know how people manage to do it. Probably they just sleep during the day and wake up and do something during night. But if you work, for example, I'm working as a teacher, so you're not supposed even to drink water during this post. For me, it's impossible. Actually, it's a strict rules for uh, for body. Yes, yes, and you must be prepared. And for example, I cannot follow this. My, my granddad and grandma are religious, but they even, they, even they don't follow because they are old. They're both 70 years old. And for them, it would be like a disaster not to eat. So mm -hmm. it's, uh, I mean, disaster for their body. Uh, for my parents, they have never followed it because my mom is a doctor. She understands that if you're not ready, not prepared for it, it can lead to different consequences. Some of them are not pleasant ones. Uh, yeah. So in, if, in, the, in the night, doctors, uh, uh, a big uh, quantity mm -hmm, mm -hmm. of uh, nutriologists in the Instagram and mm -hmm. uh, find only few doctors uh, in like a naturopath. Mm -hmm. I see, I see. Interesting, interesting. Well, so uh, I have never followed this rule, <laughs> never followed it. And uh, I have never advised anyone to follow it because if your body is not prepared, it's not yeah. worse, like it's not worse. Yeah. So, well, uh, well, I don't have any challenges on my mind yet, but when the summer will come, I will see, okay? Okay. <laughs> Challenge number two. So, well, thank you very much for sharing your experience. I was really happy to listen to you, to know your opinion. Now I know some new information as well from you uh, and uh, I, I hope that the, your next challenge will be useful and both useful and pleasant for you. Thank you so much. Let's uh, speak about uh, our challenges uh, for uh, two months, for example. Okay, yeah, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> what challenge? <laughs> okay. Oh my God. <laughs> Okay, so uh, see you. See you. Thank you for the lesson.